Hi there, I'm Peter, product lead at MailTrap. In this video, I'll show you how to use MailTrap email logs. MailTrap email logs are a powerful tool that can help you find and manage deliverability issues, better understand how an email performed or why it performed in a certain way. They provide you with insights into all emails that are sent from your account, along with relevant details, such as the status of each message, what the recipient might see, event history, HTML source, spam score, and more. We've built functionality into the log viewer to make it go beyond a set of timestamps and events into a full-fledged deliverability diagnostic tool, complete with message metadata and blacklist reports. To access the feature, in the left-hand side menu, navigate to email API slash SMTP and then to email logs. Once on the email logs page, at the very top, you'll see various preset filters. These filters are a quick way to find undelivered emails, emails that landed in spam, or emails that were sent to specific mailbox providers, such as Google, Google Workspace, Outlook, Office 365, or Yahoo. Along with the preset filters, there are also manual filters you can set up for any criteria, from a recipient's email address to the email sending domain. You can also combine manual filters by using the Add Filter button. When doing so, for some fields, you may also add multiple values to find emails matching either of them. For example, here's what's searching for emails delivered to recipients using either Google or Office 365 as their mailbox provider would look like. Now, in terms of log recency, by default, MailTrap will show email logs for the past seven days, regardless of the filters used. You can change this by selecting different start and end dates in the date range selector. Logs are accessible for up to 30 days, depending on your plan. Check out the pricing page to find out what is included in each one. Once you've adjusted the filters to show the right messages, you can move to the next stage of your investigation. Click on any one message to see detailed information about it. This will open up a new view with tabs for different aspects of the message. Let's start with the Email Info tab, which is selected by default. This tab provides the basic message details, including timestamps, status, from and to addresses, different IPs, and more. Next, in the Event History tab, will be a list of all the events that happened to a message since it was sent. For each event, you'll of course see timestamps as well as basic details. When it comes to the HTML Source tab, it will contain an email's entire HTML code, while the Text tab will enable inspecting the email's text version. For email previews, both HTML and RAW previews are available in separate tabs. And finally, for viewing spam and blacklist reports, you'll have the Spam Analysis tab featuring the two. Okay. That wraps up our overview of MailTrap email logs. For more information and tips on using the logs and other MailTrap features, check out the rest of our MailTrap tutorials or visit the Help Center. And of course, stay tuned for more things MailTrap.